Okay, welcome back to Stainless Steel for Medieval 2. Now, I'll apologise in advance because my neighbours are still doing their construction project and it's noisy. But if I don't record this today, it'll still have to be recorded at some other point um, when they're still doing their construction. So, got to be done. Right, you're going to have to give me some money because you declared war on me. That's the only thing that's going to save you. Mm, close. <clears throat> Au revoir to you too, matey. Right, the poles are getting crushed. See, that is now in the hands of the Holy Roman Empire. And there should be another diplomat right there. Is that Lake Baikal up here? Looks like a big lake. The Novgorodians have expanded massively. Oh, we're going to get some money out of them. They're bankrupt, but they don't want to give the map info. Alright, I'm going to accept that. Yeah, this is they're bankrupt, but they had money. I know, I'm an honour. Uh-uh. Look at that blob. Now, I have in fact installed two new mods this week, both for Medieval 2. Um, unfortunately, one of them has a bug in it. Um, it's not just a bug on my end. A lot of people are encountering it. It's called Steam and Steel. It has a global map, and there are indeed factions all over the map. It's a very nice looking map, um, very nice looking mod. Got a lot of potential. Um, it's kind of similar to Lucium Total War. Um, in fact, it uses some of the assets with permission from Lucium Total War team. You need some extra ships. And we're getting you some extra ships. The other mod um, actually used to be a sub mod for stainless steel. It's called Ship Stainless Steel Historical Improvement Project. And that actually adds in um, Serbia and I think three factions in the Middle East. I think it does. And that's a lot tougher than stainless steel. It's got a lot of scripts in it. Um, in fact, the uh, modding team says, if you lose on very hard, uh, be proud of that because you're supposed to. And they also said, you're quite likely to lose if you play on hard. So be forewarned. So I'm just testing that out. Um, they admit um, quite up front that there are still some bugs and they are working on it. They have in fact been working on that mod for many many years and so they're a dedicated team and I'm sure they'll get all the bugs fixed. And um, once both of those mod teams get some of the bugs fixed we'll be uploading some of those campaigns as well on the channel. Now we're back to making money, which is good, because we got kind of low. I think I need to go back and reduce taxes in some places. I had to raise them. Don't leave your taxes on very high too long. Ooh, now there's a bug in this. Alright, it's actually not going to happen this time. Um, I tried recording this earlier, and this happened, but... Um, the night attack button was active and I clicked on night attack he went dark and then I clicked automatically resolve and then the game froze up so luckily we can't do it this time <clears throat> but yeah that is in fact a bug in the mod where if you uh, agree to help but then you go click on a night battle where you won't be coming in it will kind of freeze up the king of England is dead long live the king yeah we've now got 40,000 we have 20,000 coming in 
All right, Fadmids and Sicilians. All right, but you've got a full army on board. All right, and now you've got troops. Might get away with an actual order result there. No, we're going to have to fight it out. We could easily win it, though. Hmm. Fatimids, those are going by sea. I guess they were supposed to be picking them up. That's why I thought that they would go and pick them up. Those ones retrained. We've got an assassin out there, and we've got a mission to go and kill some people over there. He keeps missing. Literally every time he started off with something like 55% chance. All right. Ah, no, I got another diplomat at Barcelona. All right. Yeah, extra diplomat Barcelona. Right, where's Barcelona? Up here. Right. He's making 300 coins. Now I'm sure we can get the order resolve here in this settlement. Because there are lots of allies around it. But I actually want to sell it now. Right. That will get us almost as much. I want to destroy their buildings, what they have left. I don't want to hold that settlement. I'll gift it to somebody else. If we can. Oh yeah, good. I do want access. Now, that'll be the last one we got. Seriously? Ah, all right, I'll just gift it to them. There. Right, now we're kind of stuck. That should keep them busy with the French. Plus, we got some extra money, honey. Are there any poles left? Not many of them. They've only got three regions, Plock, Halleck and uh, the other one. Oh, what a surprise. Nobody wants to give us map info anymore. No, oh, they really are out of money, aren't they? All right, <laughs> it's only 10 less and they weren't going to give any more this time. Hmm. All right. Well, we've got map info from them, haven't we? Who's around here? The Byzantines are expanded quite a bit as well. All right. Okay. He is going up in there. Up in there. And we've got some actual good resources around here. So I say, let's get them. And you, we're converting you in the next turn, aren't we? So get them. And you are finally going to kill off those blasted rebels. Yay! Success! That took a long time to kill them off. 
Right, I don't think there are any more out there, but you never know. Ooh, there's a, an Inquisitor. Well, you failed. And you failed. Those are useless. And he will. He will indeed. Alright, there's some who cannot be retrained. I think we're moving them around so we could retrain them. He's already retrained and I'm not worried about that. Uh huh. Right, so we've got a full stack there. Everyone's at full strength except for you. I think. Christian Guard. We will soon have some Christian Guard. There's heavy spearmen and heavy archers. Cool. We've actually been getting some family members lately. Uh, we had a drought on family members for quite a while. But we're starting to get some now. That's good. Refresh our family tree. Right. Get some growth from you. That's just an armor upgrade, I guess. They're out of imams as well, aren't they? Looks like it. If that's the case, and it looks like it, we might as well get another imam up there. I was prioritizing that settlement for imams, imam production. Right. Now we've got a lot of troops just sitting in Parma. Might as well lower that. And then we'll have you come and pick them up and any of the ones we can get from up there. Right, so we still got a lot of money and um, let's keep the French busy going after them. Because if they come after Toulouse, we've got this backup army. And now we'll have this one as well. Um, we're looking for settlements that we can sack because we don't need but three more. And we're going to get that when we turn on Castile. So I kind of do want peace with the French and the Genoese and the Sicilians and Venice. Ah, well, what a surprise. They will not leave us alone. If I was playing a Genoa, I think I would just try to capture everything in Italy. But then that would probably upset the Pope, wouldn't it? I hate dealing with the Pope, that pointy-headed person. The Pontiff. A magnificent minaret. Alright. I'm actually going to do some Attila um, Age of Charlemagne campaigns at some point. I need to find some good mods for that. Try to get rid of them. Trying to get rid of them. Yay, finally ranked up. Now where did he go, that general? There he is, moving along. Practice against him. Oh, he didn't rank up, did he? Yeah. Some will set on your life. Alright, one more turn and they will be converted over. And there's a good resource there. 500. Woohoo! Even that's worth 100. Also need an 
Imam up there, don't we? Running low on Imams. Right. Keep heading down. Keep heading along. Oh, you failed as well. And you failed. Alright, we have to get some ships over here. You need an imam as well. Alright. Whoever's at full strength can go and sit in there. Head on down. Right, you should be able to hop over and order resolve them. And then we've got you, but you are blocked at the moment. You have to come around. Right. Ah, they've taken Algiers, oh, uh, Angier. I can't talk today. <laughs> Angier, they've taken that very rapidly. But is in that? No. Where is he? Uh, yeah, it's confusing. It looked like he'd taken it, but no, he, he's just outside. Ah, oh, now it's very demanding, is it? Well, you should have taken the offer when I made it. Alright, go and deal with them. That'll stretch their armies out, and then we can go and backstab them. Iran and Belab. So there was another one to move, right? Uh, 96 to 93. You know which one we're going for? There's another one out there. Right, <clears throat> getting those ships. Now, let's see, merge up those. Put him back in his little fort. Merge those. Now they'll come again, I'm sure of that. But we'll have you coming as well. Hmm, it's already got mercenary captain. Right. Now I did say we were going to go after them, so you head over towards Venice for the time being. Yeah, they're bringing more armies in. Ah, wrong one. Blast. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Oh, there's an imperial fortress all the way up there, which is now in the hands of the Lithuanians. They must have taken it back. Must have been a crusade against them at some point. They're holding on. Seeking an audience, mighty Sultan. 
Let's get some growth going as well. Well, you're still on the front lines, aren't you? Oh, you know what, Tunis, you don't have catapults. So let's get them. There's not much to do out here. That road will help you though. Barcelona. Now help with conversion. Right. Any corruption? Two hundred. Not actually anyone who needs retraining. Let's get those ships. And still lots of money left over. Uh, corruption level's gone over 5,000 now. Yes, make those pesky French pay. We actually have a lot of French viewers at the moment, which is nice. Uh, we've actually already done a French campaign in this mod, haven't we? Uh, we've also done a French campaign in um, Shogun 2 with the Fall of the Samurai mod. Good. All family members joining up. Right, Let's see if we can get to Venice. And we got intercepted, blasted rebels. That's annoying, isn't it? We'll get there. Right. Um. Are you ready for peace yet? Uh, it's going to keep costing you. It's going to cost you. Shubadak to you too, mate. He's almost got a full stack. Hmm, that cavalry might not be able to get retrained there. Right, uh, we got some uh, Sicilians blocking us. No big deal. Let's get in some more watchtowers though. We shall see you all. Right. 155. We should be able to get most of those out. Yep. Uh -huh. Go after them. When do we get a new general? Nine turns he'll be able to head on out. Room for one more. Keep retraining. Let's go and see uh, Kiev. Seeking an 
I would have to say, if forced to do so, that the Byzantines are my favourite medieval faction. What troops do they have? Basic ones. Alright. Ooh, they've even taken that one. They've been going around the Black Sea, apparently, and taking territory. Uh, he has moved on. Ah, what happened to the rebels? Well, we abandoned that one earlier, pretty much. Who's hiding up in here? Genoese. Looks like we're wearing them down now. Yeah, if they do besiege them, I'll just destroy all those buildings. Alright, get some of those. That's pretty much an armour upgrade on all of them. Alright, you got another... No, you did not get another one. You got that one. You didn't get another one either. I'm sure I did. Very good. Well done. 342. Yeah, it is very good. Alright. Get in there. Oh, you got converted over, didn't you? That's why you're not happy. And you're barely going to be happy like that. But that should give you some uh, garrison units. And we did convert another one. Ah, finally. Finally. Well, there's another one up there. Oh, he's a powerful one, isn't he? Master Heretics. Alright. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Got lots of ships. Yeah, we only got one merchant. <sighs> right. <clears throat> well, we've got you in a good position. I think we'll go and do that one manually next time. We need to see what they're going to do. Uh, we've got extra troops there. We might need some more spies up in here. Keep an eye on them. I think those will come in useful. Right. Now we converted someone else. Who was it? It was Algiers, wasn't it? They seem to be okay. Because they're still getting free upkeep from those. Right. Grenadine Lancers, Christian Guard Cavalry. Can we not get those? No, we can't. Ooh. That's two extra heavy cav units. Um, we'll take six turns. We can afford it. We don't have access to those anywhere else, as far as I know. Right. Independent Fortress. Eh. Yeah, I expect they're going to keep coming after us. But, again, we're going to have two full stacks to deal with them. I do have all those ships there, though. Yeah, we can't retrain him, or even him, or even them.
we might be able to pop over and sack some of those cities. That one doesn't look like it's got anyone in it, but it's got a full stack. For real. Okay, that's where we end of this one.